Come, let us prepare and make some good profits today. Mark left us some clues right here. I will be talking about that in today's video. We had our 50 point day. Big clues right here. I will talk about that as well. But before that intraday analysis, it's important that you understand the rhythms at play so you can translate them into the 30 minute chart for more macro structure. Now at 9.37, we broke out of this green rhythm. Now if you remembered yesterday's video, we talked about this, right? I mentioned that the bulls can be building liquidity right here. And you had to look out for that breakout at this level. Now, once you understand this, you know what kind of structure to be looking out for today. So right at the start at 9.49, we were waiting out for the dual rhythms. And you see them, the yellow and the magenta. We were waiting out for that magenta breakout right there. And you see how beautiful the market grabbed the liquidity from the breakout of the magenta here. Now we have another microstructure here. Absolutely beautiful on the breakout. And that's where you have that nested head and shoulder inverse to break us out of that blue five one three beautiful trade right here. As long as you are able to understand the algorithms here and also understand the macro structure which we were waiting for which was this breakout of this green algorithm because you understood that the bulls were building liquidity on this breakout right here grabbing that right shoulder beautiful trade now there after 11 26 this was when we identified the green rhythm now just take a look here at this beautiful structure of this green rhythm and we started forming a microstructure here so take a look we formed the cup right and we formed that beautiful structure here we were looking for a handle from that cup thereafter and you see that we started forming the handle right there beautiful trade now i will show you this microstructure of the handle in the next one at 1236 right here when you see the volume coming in and you have to understand we identified the algorithms right here which was this magenta and this green now i want you to see very clearly here we started forming the cup right so we are waiting for the handle it's the exact same algorithm and you see how the handle started forming giving us that beautiful beautiful trade right here so two beautiful trades because you understood how to be looking out for that green algorithm right there. And I mentioned as well that you can see very clearly that the green algorithm was in control and you just have to manage your risks accordingly. Take the trade, beautiful trade. Now the buyers were having some trouble and this was why I mentioned you have to be looking out for that orange tapering algorithm right here. Now I want you to understand that we started tapering with the orange algorithm here. So when you can see the orange in control and starting to taper, you see how we will start tapering here. And you have a beautiful trade here. If you waited for that orange breakout, some of the members caught this because you were patient, well done. And thereafter, you had to wait for that handle to start to form right here. So this was at 118. You could have waited for this trade here. You had to be very patient. And we had another microstructure here at this three o'clock. 312. Now this was not easy. We ran out of runway for the day, but you can see how beautiful that blue and orange created that head and shoulder structure on the breakdown. This was already after hours, but you can see that the tapering created the need for this microstructure to form before it started pushing down. Now members who did well today, you train your eyes to be looking at the algorithms. Very importantly, you remain patient because today was a very choppy day, but the market was just building liquidity. And if you trained your eyes to be looking at the algorithms, you would be able to identify liquidity and avoid being one. Instead, you start to grab liquidity. You enter the trade based on structure. You didn't overtrade and you found profits in the charts. So you realize regardless, even if spies just chopping in a one point range, you can find profits in the charts. And that's exactly what we need to do. So well done members. Now, where do we go from here? Now at this point here, you have to understand exactly where we are right now, All right? We had that orange buying continuation and we had a breakout here. Now, any guesses where this breakout is? At this orange? Absolutely. So this was where we had to be waiting out for earlier when we were seeing some tapering. I was also talking about the 30 minute chart here 
on the orange retest. So you see there is a certain imbalance giving us that breakdown here. And now we have that handle that started forming. And now we need to see some continuation structure right here. So you want to see continuation structure here. You need to see that we start selling at a stronger orange rhythm right here. Now, in order for there to be selling, you need to see where the target for the bears are. Now, we do have this other yellow rhythm that's still in play here. So if you want to see this going down, we will have to retest yellow 512 if this is going down in the longer term. Now, there will be five day moving average at 511 now. It will most likely trend up to 512. So that's where you can see the possibility of taking a structure here, right? Maybe we break down here. There's so much liquidity. So you have to pay close attention to this. So you want to see market retesting the algorithms here. Now we are forming an inverse cup. We started closing 512, probably five day moving average trend to this point here. Now you want to look out for that blue algorithm. If we have the blue algorithm right here, this is what you want to be looking out for in today's structure with the blue tapering algorithm right there. Now we have a gap to fill if this goes down. So you have to pay close attention to the structure, especially yellow 512 and where five day moving average will be if we are starting to trend down right here. Now you do see that we start to have some weakness here, but this is not strong enough for a control algorithm for the bears. So you want to be looking out for the yellow and obviously the blue. If we are dumping at this range right here. Now, however, you do see that the magenta is still firmly in control, especially with the green nearing to the end of the day as well. So pay close attention where five day is. This can still build liquidity and break us out of range here. Absolutely possible, but you have to pay close attention to the blue. And this could be where you gauge your risk to reward, see if it makes sense. So you have to wait for a clearer structure before you take a trade like this. Look out for the magenta, look out for the green tapering rhythm right there. You have to find the right support in this case, five day moving average, pay close attention to that. So it's quite straightforward. We have all the rhythms. Thank you very much for watching. See you closer to opening bill.